I'm Jeremy Wade, fisherman and biologist. There it is, there it is, there it is! For over 30 years, I've traveled the world's seas and rivers, searching out incredible fish. Uh, I'm gonna have to go for a swim. That are usually hidden from view. Uh. But over that time, these monsters have become harder and harder to find. Many kinds of fish are migratory, meaning they have to swim between different places. Normally it's because they feed in one kind of water, but they need to breed in a different kind of water. Some migrate relatively short distances up and downstream, but others make truly epic journeys. Some traversing oceans, distances of thousands of miles. Some traveling right the way to the headwaters of rivers. And all the time they're dodging predators, they're battling powerful currents sometimes even making their way up waterfalls. Look at this. Many of these are obviously important to people, the basis of a worldwide fishing industry worth billions of dollars. The thing is, we rely on fish, but what we often forget is that they also rely on us. On my expeditions, much of my time is spent traveling by river. And if I run up against one of these, I can just go round it. Imagine you're driving to work or to the shops and suddenly there's a roadblock you can't get past. It's the same kind of thing for fish, except we don't normally see it. What we want to try and do in the case of fish is to remove the roadblocks, or at the very least create a well-signposted diversion so they can get past these man-made obstacles, principally dams and weirs. It's actually a similar thought process to this bridge. If that wasn't there, I would still be stuck on the other bank. The more people we can make aware of the problems faced by fish, the more chance we have to find solutions. World Fish Migration Day celebrates the many species of migratory fish that share our planet and aims to raise awareness of the importance of free-flowing streams and rivers. For this year's campaign, the happy fish symbolises these things. This April 21st, there'll be events and action around the globe. And that's where you come in. Visit the website at worldfishmigrationday.com to join an event local to you. Or you can even organise your own. Happy World Fish Migration Day! The more waterways that we can make accessible and free-flowing, the more our streams and rivers will be full of healthy, happy fish. <laughs>